Okay, Christy's doing a front alternating lunge. So she's stepping out, making sure to keep the front leg at a 90 degree angle, almost touching the back knee to the floor. And she's lunging and then pushing off her heel to come back to her start position. Chest is out, back is straight, shoulders down away from the ears and abs in tight. Thanks for the reminder. <laughs> okay, so next we'll do a reverse lunge. Okay. Okay, so this is almost the same. She's just stepping backwards instead of forwards. She's going to alternate. And Christy's got good balance, so she's able to do this without holding on, but it's fine to hold on to a chair or couch or something. Yeah. Same thing on the front knee, you want to keep that at about a 90 degree angle. So this time when you come back to your start position, you're pushing off your toe. Okay, and then we can do that reverse lunge with a kick. Okay. Okay, so same reverse lunge and then just coming into a kickbox style kick where the knee bends. And holding your stomach in on this one is key to not falling over. A little harder to balance on this one also. You want to just use your arms however out to the side or whatever helps you stay balanced. Okay. And then lunge, jumping lunge. Okay, so this is the plyometric version of the lunge to recruit those fast twitch muscle fibers. Great for muscle development. Also great for a little bit of cardio. So on this one you really want to use your arms kind of in a circle motion to help get you up off the ground to have time to switch your legs. Okay.